I think uh, where we could uh, help to bring answers is uh, answer the question we're talking about mobile financial services. Uh, on which mobile platforms will they be made available? And which platforms uh, we can use to increase uh, financial inclusion? So we came up with the idea a couple of years ago to not only make uh, financial services uh, products pr uh, available on smart phones, but also on smart watches. And so whether people were questioning a lot about uh, the added value of that a couple of years ago is becoming more and more clear that there is definitely some different uh, features and functions and value propositions which would be made available uh, if uh, applications uh, are going to be developed also for smart watches to handle financial products. And actually, as a matter of fact, it's already the case because some banks already have gone in that direction. Right, so we started with that as well a couple of years ago. So we started to offer uh, uh, concepts around uh, SMS uh, trend based transactions. Okay, today uh, most of smartwatches are still connected to the smartphone. So uh, we are more talking about uh, timely uh, notifications, information, and decision taking. Whereas the next generation of uh, smartwatches will be unconnected to the smart. Uh, phone. So this will open again uh, the, the number of applications and features and functions which can be made available because we are talking about a way to reach uh, the consumer directly and, and to develop new channels for financial products. Of course, one of the challenges with uh, digital finance is uh, identity management. Uh, might uh, smartwatch be, you know, one of the key tools for uh, securing uh, digital identities? Absolutely, we are uh, uh, using something called uh, biometrics technology, uh, which can uh, be incorporated in smartwatches and which, uh, without uh, any failure, can identify uh, the identity of the user of the smartwatch and the application and uh, the financial transactions initiated by them. So it's definitely uh, one of the most uh, secure uh, ways to authorize financial transactions in the future, but also uh, today already, I would say. You know, uh, we are based in Switzerland. We are a Smith uh, smartwatch company, which is kind of unique because when you think about Swiss watches, you don't think immediately about smartwatches. Uh, but we came up a couple of years ago with uh, concepts uh, to combine classical watch technology with smartwatch technology. And we think uh, the future is going to go in that direction, just like it went in other industries. I mean, the car technology, we're talking about hybrid cars. Uh, uh, who are amongst the most powerful and expensive and so it will go in the watch industry. So whereas maybe other providers have been offering computers on wrists, we uh, offer full-blown uh, watches, even luxury watches on the wrist which have smart functions. Yeah.